As Alec Baldwin faces involuntary manslaughter charges for the fatal 2021 shooting of cinematographer Helena Hutchins, prosecutors are prepared to argue that the actor and executive producer had absolutely no control of his own emotions during his time on set. In an April 8 court filing obtained by People, New Mexico state prosecutors alleged that Baldwin, 66, was inattentive during firearms training and frequently screaming and cursing on set prior to the incident, all of which contributed to the tragedy. To watch Mr. Baldwin's conduct on the set of Rust is to witness a man who has absolutely no control of his own emotions and absolutely no concern for how his conduct affects those around him, wrote Special Prosecutors Carrie T. Morrissey and Jason J. Lewis. Witnesses have testified that it was this exact conduct that contributed to safety compromises on set. Per BBC, the filing continued, Mr. Baldwin was frequently screaming and cursing at himself, at crew members, or at no one, and not for any particular reason. Prosecutors further allege that the actor has shamelessly lied by continuously changing his story after the incident. This development follows a March motion from Baldwin's legal team to throw out the charges against him, which were refiled in January in an indictment from a New Mexico grand jury. Entertainment Weekly has reached out to Baldwin's legal team for comment. Hutchins was killed and director Joel Souza was wounded on October 21, 2021, when a gun being wielded as a prop by Baldwin discharged a live round. Baldwin was told the gun was cold, meaning it did not contain live ammunition, and he has maintained that he did not pull the trigger. The film's armorer, Hannah Gutierrez-Reed, who was responsible for loading the live round into the gun Baldwin used, was convicted last month on one count of involuntary manslaughter. Over the course of her 10-day trial, prosecutors argued that Gutierrez-Reed was neglectful in her duties supervising the safety of the prop weapons on Rust and unknowingly brought live ammunition to the production and allowed it to remain on set for at least 12 days. The defense implicated Baldwin, the film's star and executive producer, arguing that the negligence on set extended beyond the armorer. Gutierrez faces up to 18 months in prison and is due to be sentenced next week. Baldwin is expected to stand trial for involuntary manslaughter in July.